On Friday, September 19th, Ohio Governor Ted Strickland spoke to supporters on the campus of Ohio University. Strickland focused on the need for change in the country's economy and the plans Barack Obama has for the future if elected. Night before last, because we had no electricity at the governor's residence, I was in bed fairly early and Barack Obama woke me up with a phone call. And uh, he wanted to know how things were going in Ohio. And I said, Senator, I owe you my candid opinion. And I'm going to tell you what I think is happening in Ohio. I said, I think things are very tight. I think this election is virtually a toss-up right now. I believe that neither you nor Senator McCain has solidified the kind of support they need in Ohio to win. These are serious times, my friends. The economic circumstances facing us today are probably as serious as any we have faced, perhaps in my lifetime, and I'm 57 years old. We need, desperately need, mature, committed, compassionate leadership in the presidency. But I believe we can do better, and I believe the people of our region know that we can do better with the right kind of leadership. So I ask you, over the next few days, do everything that you can. You all have a sphere of influence. There are people who will listen to you that won't listen to Ted Strickland or Debbie Phillips. These are people who won't listen to Barack Obama or Joe Biden. They won't listen to Sherrod Brown, but they will listen to you. And you can say to them, Barack Obama, is the person that we need to support and vote for. Good old Athens County will do what Athens County has done in the past. And if it's an election that is decided by 100 or 200 or 400 or 600 votes, Athens County will be the county that makes the difference. Thank you very much. Well, we know what we have. Ohio's lost over 200,000 jobs uh, since George Bush has been president. Uh, this economic um, situation that we have today is absolutely calamitous. Uh, we are on the verge of some of our major financial institutions failing. People are losing confidence in our, in our financial structure uh, in this country, and that's quite serious. Barack Obama has a plan for renewable energy, the creation of, of new green-color jobs as we focus on wind power and solar power and clean coal technologies and biofuels. And John McCain, quite frankly, uh, wants to pursue the same approach that we've had in the past. The drill, baby drill, is, uh, seems to be the theme of, of the uh, McCain campaign. So there are major, major differences in terms of health care. Uh, Barack Obama has a plan that will make affordable, accessible health care available to everyone who needs it. And John McCain, what does he want to do? He wants to tax uh, employer-provided health benefits and he wants to continue the Bush policies of letting the private sector take care of it. If you like the way things are, then you should support John McCain, because John McCain has pretty much promised to continue the policies of George Bush. Um, but if you think we can do better, if, if you think that we new, do need new leadership, then Barack Obama is our candidate. I think it's as simple as that. Do we want more of the same, or do we want positive change and greater opportunity? And I think Barack Obama will bring us the change we need.